so in this video we are going to see about the selection process and the exam pattern of junior executive air traffic control that is a recruitment happening from airport authority of india there is 264 vacancies and this is a big opening uh, and the application uh, registration will start only from 15th of december so there is time for applications to start and also there is a lot of openings please do watch the video on recruitment first and then if you are interested in applying please do watch this video till the end okay so here in this video we will be discussing about the selection process and the exam pattern of air traffic controller post okay so if you don't know what is an air traffic controller job it is actually uh, monitoring and tracking of planes and giving instructions to the uh, the pilots and uh, keeping track of the plane all those areas it is uh, being dealt by the air traffic control department of airport authority of india okay so the job is actually related to that area and in this video we are going to see about the selection process that is how um, the air traffic controller is getting selected or what all stages are present in selection and also we will be seeing the exam pattern okay so the selection process of an atc consists of mainly six stages the first stage is online examination there are two parts on the online examination we will be seeing the exam pattern later so the first stage is online examination Second stage is document verification. Third stage is voice test. Means uh, there will be a test uh, in which you will be tested for uh, any problems in speaking or stammering problems or anything. That type of a test is the voice test. And the fourth one is personal interview will be there. That is you will be asked questions regarding your interest in joining Airport Authority of India in this particular area. That is ATC. If you are really interested or not, they will be testing. Then fifth one is medical test. And the last stage is background verification. Okay, so this much of stages are there in the selection process: online examination, document verification, voice test, personal interview, medical examination or medical test, and background verification. And also, they have said that the candidate should be having a minimum proficiency in reading and writing of English subject. That is, you should be having a proficiency of twelfth qualification. Okay, so. 12 standard proficiency you should be having in reading and writing of English. Okay. And also you should have studied English subject in either your 10th standard or your 12th standard or you should and also you should have passed that subject. Okay. So this is mandatory for applying for this post. These two things we have specifically mentioned. And also if you are uh, a candidate who is belonging to BE or BTEC qualification, you should have studied physics and maths also. Uh, and that is in any of your semesters. If you have studied physics and maths as a subject in any of the semesters only, then you are eligible to apply. Okay. So these things they have said they have said is mandatory. So that's all about the selection process. Moving on to the exam pattern. So the exam pattern, there is two stages in the question paper or the online examination. There is a part A, which is a general section. It is having 60 questions, and there is a part B which is consisting of questions from physics and maths, there is again 60 questions. Totally 60 plus 60, 120 questions is there. And the total time duration is 120 minutes. Okay, the questions will be in both uh, English and Hindi mediums. Okay, and also there is no negative marking. So let us see about part A first, that is a general session. Then we'll be seeing part B. Okay, so the general section consists of English subject, general intelligence and reasoning, general aptitude and numerical ability, general awareness and general knowledge. Okay, so this much of areas are present in part A and the number of marks given to each areas I will be sharing. The first one is English subject, there is 20 mark from English subject, then general intelligence and reasoning, 15 marks. General uh, aptitude and numerical ability, 15 marks. General knowledge in current affairs, 10 mark. Totally 60 mark is your part A. That is, that is a general session. Okay. And it is given 50 percentage weightage. Okay. Then part B consists of physics and maths. And the questions will be from your 12th standard. Okay. 12th standard level of questions you can expect from the physics and maths. There will be 60 questions. Okay, so that is the exam pattern. Totally 60 plus 60, 120 questions and 
120 minutes each question will be having one mark and there is no negative marking okay so that is the exam pattern so uh, we have seen what is an ATC job and also we have discussed what is the selection process which are the stages present in the selection process and also we have seen about the exam pattern so if you are interested in applying for this job please do start applying from 15th of December there is time uh, for the online registrations to start so if you are interested first please do go over to the notification and then start applying from 15th of December okay so this is the selection process and exam pattern so if you are interested or if you are going to apply you should do your preparation in this way because you you have to cover all these areas for your preparation okay so the first stage is online exam only if you get through this online examination you will get to the next stages okay so first thing you have to do is you have to prepare for this examination so these are all areas you have to prepare I'm really hoping that you found this video useful if you are interested in applying for this job if yes please do give it a thumbs up please do share it with your friends and if you want more videos please do subscribe to the channel thanks for watching and keep on watching